What up? What up? What up? Adromatic back here with y'all in the garage. Working on the cutlass today. Got the trusty jack back. I gotta slowly bring my stuff back in the garage, man. Got the jack stands ready. So you know we ready to work. Uncle and little cuzzo pulling up. Look, cuz I'm real excited about working on it, man. That's cool. Kid him in his hobbies, you know. Kid this little goofball go right here. So, where's the man? What you think about the cutlass, man? Why are you running away? <laughs> That's cool. Yeah. Got big Bertha. Ain't no parking. So, look cold and wet today. It's rainy. Or rain or shine, son. Yeah, so they said we're gonna work on it and stop being lazy. That's what we're gonna do. Yeah. Got this joint three reeling right now. So, yeah, I didn't have as much space as I thought, man. I don't know how Pops did it with the Impala in here, man. In ingenuity. So we're gonna try to get the front wheel off and this the front uh, shock off right now. Yeah, I gotta save my back. Got a little cuz right here showing them. And be careful when you're getting towards the towards the end because you could drop it and you're gonna hit the rim. So don't drop it. You could take it out with your hand now. Do the other one. Put them somewhere safe. Well, it's always messing with these cars. Yeah, we made a big mess. So, you already know what's next. <laughs> so we're gonna see if we can put some heat to it and break it loose. Damn, y'all had a failed day, man. So the top we got off. Let me see where the light. The top bolt, I was able to get off. I just put it in there for right now. Failed day, and I threw some paint. Yeah, all on the in the fender wells and on the frame back there too. And then I'm gonna throw on the chrome rallies. But the bottom, man, the bottom two bolts got like stripped out or something. So we gotta go back to the thinking board. See what we could do to to fix that issue but yeah i'm gonna throw the chrome rallies right now for the day and see what's to it gotta go back back to the drawing board man so but we did a little something i got cuz wrens over there taking out the rear tent we're gonna get some goo gone so yeah bring it back once we lower the car get it all the way down that's cool so since you can't take the shocks off um, we're just gonna clean it up. Something else we've been wanting to do too. Cause I mean, if I'm not gonna, if I'm not gonna be able to change one, why change all of them? I want to try to do it all at once. So, like I said, we're gonna go back to the drawing board on the shocks, but we're gonna put the chrome rallies and just paint up the wheel wells for the day. And maybe we could get Uncle Lou ace one mechanic out here to help us out so we'll bring you back once i'm painting all right so here it is i just do some quick paint on it clean it up so it looks good don't look too bad so we're gonna go ahead and slap the wheel on the back see how it looks let me cut off the light man that cleaned it up so much we getting it ready, guys. Man, today we're supposed to go look at a a built 5.3 engine and trans. But the guy said that the shop is closed, so it's at a shop right now. He's giving us a good deal. If it is what it is, we got to go find out. We're going to go check it out. we waiting for Uncle Lou to check it out. So we're probably going to have to look at it this weekend. Or not this weekend, but this week. Upcoming week. Let's check it out, man. Look at that. Woo! Favorite wheel of all time. 
So we're gonna put it on one side so I can finally see how my dream wheels look like on my dream car, man. Let's check it. All right, y'all. So we're gonna scratch the shocks for the day. It's kind of shitty out, man. It was literally just snowing too. So we're right here. I flipped the car to the other side. Let me just give this a little paint too, just so it looks good with the wheels, man. So get back to you. Just want to give you a quick before. It goes that after. Looking pretty good. These two fools talking about Jordan and Kobe. I mean Jordan and LeBron. It's just a totally different day, man. Yeah, so we're gonna put the wheel on, drop into the rear real quick. Looking real good. Real good. And it's the last corner right here. Just threw a few coats on. This car's pretty clean. I mean, it's got a little body rust. It's got one hole. It's getting there. Yeah. So, I should I actually I didn't crawl up under there. Let's do that real quick. Go ahead, let it up. So do nothing, man. We gotta paint the car anyway, man. I know. I don't want to leave it there, man. <laughs> Let's crawl up under here and see. Just surface rust. This joint, joint all pretty clean. I did see one hole under the driver's side, but other than that, I didn't get it. But you can kind of see it. You can kind of see it over there. So we gotta order. I order the driver pan up. Okay. So that's that's what it needs. But we're still gonna pull, we're still gonna pull out the carpet. Cause I think uh, some new carpet will really look, look real good. So yeah, she's pretty clean, man. I think we got a real good deal on this car cause I haven't seen nothing but buckets for sale. Nothing less than 5,000. You know what I mean? Yeah. What you guys think, man? We're gonna pull it out right now. Get you a better view. We got a little cuz right here using that chrome cleaner. Some tire shine. What you think about it, Renz? How you feel about working on it? It's, it's, it's still in progress. <laughs> yeah, he pulled the, the tin out in the back. So, yeah, it came out exactly how I thought. So we got some goo gone. We're gonna see how that works. But, he did his thing last week, man, cleaning the interior out. Pretty clean. Suede headliner. It's a good car, man. So right now I'm gonna pull it out. Get you guys a full 360 view. Let it cut it. Finally, it's been, been years. I actually had these rallies for about three, four years. And I finally started buying cars and put some tires on it, on them. Yeah, man, that's all life's about. You set some goals, you go achieve them. That's what we're trying to teach this young boy. So, yeah, man, achieve, achieve, achieve those goals. Whatever you set your mind to, do it. Because you can. It just takes some hard work.
Nice. There you go. Good like night, Devin. Take it easy. It needs a motor. Man, I just checked. I wonder if. Damn. What do you guys think? Because they got 255s in the back. I think it was just warming up. That's why I kept dying. Still pretty cold out here today. Damn, that motherfucker looked good. Hold on. Need a thumbnail right now. That's gonna be it right there. Woo. Man, the tires are beefy in the back. There's 235 60s in the front, 255 60 in the back. Fill it out some. Give it that muscle look. Yeah, I gotta do. I think this front driver's side needs a spring. But yeah, it look good. I wonder if you can tell how wide they are. Yeah, they got some decent little meats back there. So, just wanted to show y'all. Right now we're gonna we're gonna take off the the office adhesive in the back window because we pulled off the tent but left a whole bunch of adhesive. So just wanted to show y'all what we've been doing this weekend. But yeah, we're gonna go to try to check out that motor. It's a rebuilt 5.3 with the trans. Ready to drop in. It just needs a harness. So it should, which would be good, it'll give us some tunability. Man, this motherfucker look good though. So we'll be checking that out because he's giving us a good deal on it. And I feel like might as well buy one that's rebuilt already. You know what I'm saying? So yeah guys, to the next one. Sam.